uh, put up a note today to gather some intel on the animatronics from the other employees. Uh, just to get a list of the, um, of them. They've written down some stuff here for you, so uh, let's see. Alright, so obviously the animatronics walk around at night, you know that by now. Uh, they try to get to places they shouldn't be. Uh-huh, yep. They act weird after dark. Yep. They don't like adults. Hmm. I mean, I suppose. They always seem nice around children. Around us employees, they just kind of stare at you. I always thought they just hadn't been coded to interact with anyone other than children. But some of the other employees have felt threatened by them now and then. But I know that some of them are also superstitious morons. So who knows if they just became scared when the animatronic looked at them in the eyes or something. Anyway, one last thing on the list here. The last penguin interferes with the system. There's a sentence I never thought I'd say. Uh, we have these penguin animatronics as waiters. Uh, they take people's orders and whatnot. We used to have three of them, but two of them broke down and haven't been fixed yet. I think they're referring to the third penguin that still works. Or, well, apparently it doesn't quite work. So yeah, definitely don't let him into the office. His presence alone could probably destroy our systems. Well, that'll be it for now. I'll be sure to leave another message for your next shift.
see. Awesome job these last two nights. You're already way better than our previous night guard. He didn't even stand two nights before he brought a wrench to his shift and tried to destroy one of our animatronics. The animatronic in question is the blank printer, uh, the one in the drawing room on uh, camera 11, I think. Yeah, I'm surprised he still works. And despite the holes and the fact that his left arm and the back of his head is missing, the kids still really like him. Anyway, ever since that day, Blank's been acting almost more strange than the other animatronics. Like, among other things, he seems to have developed this fascination with getting into the office through the day. And I guess he can't see the glass or something. So yeah, uh, keep an eye on him. If you see him heading for the ticket booth, just shut the door in his face and then he'll find something else to do, I guess. Oh, and uh, by the way, ever since that new Freddy Fazbear's Pizza closed up, we've been getting more and more customers during the day. So next week, if you're up for it, we could use you on the day shift. Think it over. We'll talk later.